Kelly. New for you tonight, nearly 100 people gathered outside the State House to protest the government's building of pipelines, specifically the Dakota Access Pipeline. Many of them held signs against the project. One protester told us he just got back from a reservation in South Dakota. He says the area that's being disturbed is a sacred land where relatives are buried. You know, no, everyone would be upset if we tried to bulldoze through a veteran military like place like that. So why is it any different for us? Why is it any different for the indigenous people? He hopes the more people who protest, the closer they are to stopping the pipelines. Now, the developer of the Dakota Access Pipeline was just told it will have to present evidence at a hearing. They have to prove the company did not willfully violate North Dakota rules by not showing how it planned to avoid disturbing Native American artifacts during construction.